All right, so here we go with the haul for this week. Uh, last one for October. Um, this should be uh, Halloween. And don't have anything really Halloween-y <laughs> to, uh, to put in here. I got like one item um, that's like really Halloween-y. So I don't think that's a word, but you can like hashtag it and see what happens. Anyway, here we go. So I'm only getting the Dinobots out of the Transformers Mashers. S sort of. Like I don't really care for the Bumblebee. That'll be like a birthday present or something for the almost four-year-old, three-and-a-half-year-old. Um, I think he'll like that, but I just wanted this, the swoop. Or, tch, straight, yeah, right. The swoop that was in here. Um, that was cool, and I got it. It was like a twenty-four ninety-nine at um, Target, and then if you look, some of the packages have buy two, get five bucks off, or buy three and get eight dollars off, which, of course, you buy two, it's the better deal, because if you buy two, then you come back and you buy two later, then you've gotten ten dollars off four. So, that's slightly better than the $8. Anyway, so I got this guy. It was cool. So, it ended up being like, uh, depending on how you look at it, because I did buy two sets, I spent um, 35 bucks on the two sets, and then I got 5% off that, because they're at Target. So, yeah, I guess I did okay. Anyway, there's this set. And there's the other set that I got. It was um, Jetfire. I was kind of like, eh. Wasn't sure if I wanted to get it, but kind of wanted to use that coupon, and that was one that I kind of wanted, so I went and got him. So he's kind of cool. So I got, got Jet Fire there. Um, kind of neat. Heat Wave, haven't seen that guy yet. Rodimus, haven't seen him yet. And Power Rangers. Now, I'm not a huge Power Ranger fan. Like, not at all. Like, by the time these guys came out, I was kind of, like, done with that stuff. And then finally, once I got a little bit older, kind of that nostalgia hit and I had a little bit of money. And then, you know, 3,000 figures. Who am I kidding? 10,000 figures later. Uh, these are pretty cool. Like, I really dug the 8-inch um, Thundercats figures they did. Both of them. And then they did the 6-inch. And these are based on the same kind of body as the 8-inch. Um, and they're really kind of neat. So, and I got the green and the white. And another green. And wherever he went, I uh, got another green open. And it may, it may, in fact, be another one here somewhere. But I got these two this week. And I think I already had this. Or, well, the one that's loose I already had. I've got a white one somewhere, so pretty neat. Um, it's kind of cool getting this form of him without the armor, because you always saw him with the armor. And you got Saba there, so eh. I got a friend that's into Power Rangers. He's kind of schooled me on the stuff, and it's like oh, that's cool. I'll get like the Mighty Morphin eight inch. So I got him. Um, let's see. Finally got me an, oh, an Ultron. I think I sold the one I had before, and I think I paid a little bit less. So I guess I came out okay. It's like. Kind of wanted to get the select, and then I saw the select, and I'm like, oh, I wish I got my other Ultron. And then, after going through probably dozens of these, looking for you know paint that I like, because like a lot of them have different variations on the paint, like more a lot of blue or no blue, whatever. Finally came across this one, and he has like just the right amount of blue. So really happy with this guy. I think the other one I had had some weird paint stuff with the head. This one looks great. So now I've got me an extra head for uh, Iron Monger, which yeah, whatever. And I got Autobot Skids, which I know before, wouldn't he uh, like a black van in G1 or a dark blue van in G1? But uh, this is like a real G1 looking figure. I mean, a lot of the IDW stuff is. Um, so I didn't got this guy. He's, yeah, it's kind of cool. Uh, so we'll open him up. We'll do a review of him and probably um, Orion Pax. And uh, I think those are the two Transformers that I, I got that are actually Transformers. Yeah. Let's see. And I got him another Scarecrow. And another red hood. So I got, got another set down here. And I just uh, took a friend of mine, uh, took him a red hood. So yeah, I got two red hoods and two scarecrows. So if anybody's looking for a scarecrow and a red hood, let me know. I got I got an extra set. And put them down here. And then today I got this guy. Uh, and the reason I got him, you know, I've already got the, the first one that came out. And then I missed the spring-loaded one. I was like, oh, crap, really with the spring-loaded. And I was like, almost got that one. And then I saw where this guy was coming out. And this is like the RoboCop 3 version. And he has like the 50 cal. Well, I'll show you. It has like the 50 cal um, sniper rifle and the snap-on machine gun and the jetpack. And he has the spring-loaded um, thigh. So I was like, yes. Awesome. So I got the regular one, which is like a more of a silver. And this one's more of a blue and has like that crazy oily look to it, I guess, that prismatic glued steel kind of look. NECA is awesome, as always. Um, yeah. 
Sweet. And then these are pretty much for the kids. Uh, the Hulk just came out. Um, and then this is my only Halloween thing that I got. Well, not really. I guess I got another one, but it's a buy two for twenty five, and I had a five dollar coupon. So I got them. I guess they were twenty. I didn't look at the receipt and see um, what got taken off. But you know they do. They take your five bucks and they spread it out among everybody. But in my mind, I got these guys like two for twenty bucks. And yeah, I keep on finding these dudes, and I keep on getting a pack for me. And then doggone, I already had a pack. Um, for a friend of mine so just got to get his to him and then I may or may not open one up I don't know see what they're, they're going for these things are going for like 50 bucks for a while so yeah I digress and yeah, that's right I got the Taylor Swift CD we won't, we won't linger on that um, oh yeah here's my other one so I got the um, reaction Jack Skellington and doggone it it wasn't punched and I had the little thing it was like kind of Hanging on pretty good, because it was like semi-punched, I guess, and I lost it. So, oh well. Um, kind of cool, it's like a little pumpkin with a ghost coming out of it. Not really, like, he's like tall and lanky, but not like as lanky as, well obviously if you look in the background there, you can see. And I don't know if I had this one on my last review or not, or my last haul. Got a G.I. Joe number one. This thing is like minty. I mean, I went through and checked the corners. The papers are uh, the papers are a little bit off white, not much, not, not near as bad. Like I didn't know paper was that white back then, but it's pretty white, so it's pretty cool. Got a good deal. It's less than thirty bucks. So I got the giant size, and I got the omnibus, whatever the, the compilation trade paperback graphic novel, whatever you want to call it. So there, that's my haul. Kind of like um, kind of tired tonight, guys. Been kind of sick, so uh. Yeah, so that's my haul. Thanks for watching. Yeah.